all right guys welcome back today i'm gonna show you the best settings for visibility for fps performance all of that but before the video starts i would really appreciate if you could leave a like and subscribe that helps me more than you would think but yeah let's get right into it all right and to keep a reference point i am right here on woods just if you wanna compare yours to mine let's start off with game settings automatic ram cleaner i would say keep that off or if you feel like the game is like after a few raids are getting a bit laggy just restart the game that's what i had to do back in the day only use physical cores i can't really say yes or no so experiment with that i don't know it's really weird on some maps i gain fps with it some maps i lose fps so i i just have it off now you have to try it out fov this is a personal preference. I'd say keep it from 59 to 66. This is 50. This is so shit. This is 75. It's a bit much, right? It's a bit much. At least for me. I, I can't really play like this. So I have it at 62. Which I think is the sweet spot. Head bobbing. Drag that down to the lowest. Go to graphics settings. Play at your native resolution. If you feel like you want to get more performance out of it, use DLSS. But always keep this on your native to keep it as sharp as possible. Full screen, then your aspect ratio. 95% of you will have 16.9. Texture quality medium or high. Don't go low. Even if you have a GPU from the 90s, keep it on medium. I mean, if you're getting like 20 FPS, then okay. Maybe put that on low. But medium or high. I have it on medium. Just because I can't really tell a difference. Shadows low. Object LOD quality. 2. Overall visibility. 400. This is view distance. This is 400 right here. And on woods in an offline raid. While recording I get 85 FPS. And then this is on 3000. It doesn't really change the FPS. It's 3 FPS difference. But in, in an actual game. This setting. Keep it on 400 or 1000. TAA. Resampling. Keep that off. Like I said with the texture quality. If you're down really bad. And drag that down to 075. It just makes the game. I would, I would say a bit blurry. But it makes the game really blurry. But you see the FPS. Jumped up. There is 05 resampling, 140 FPS. It looks NVIDIA DLSS. Keep that off. Either off or quality. I used to have this on quality for the longest time. But the scopes just doesn't look great. Gets a bit blurry. The grass just looks blurry. Uh, just keep that off. AMD FSR also off. HBAO off. Green space reflections off. Anostropic filtering if you have 16 gigabytes or lower, keep this off. If you have more than 16, keep it on. NVIDIA reflex low latency, on plus boost. There's another thing, sharpness. It does affect the FPS, but also not. Like, it doesn't really matter. I have it on 2, which is a bit high, but I like it. I see some people playing with it on 0, and like, how can you do that? I like it sharp. And then all of these, just keep them off can barely tell a difference and your fps will go down by like 15 all right and here under post effects press visualize so you can change the options while you see the difference i will do a upcoming video where i go more in depth on why i have these settings what all these settings do and what you can do to see more but my post effects with it on 85 of 89 so you see 90 so it takes some fps out of it but i feel like it's worth it the ones you should keep away from is clarity luma sharpen and adaptive sharpen they take down let's see if i turn them all on this is a bit extreme but let's just see 75 so it takes down the fps by 10 and it looks shit i want to have clarity on but uh it's just too demanding all right and now going into more windows settings I'm gonna start off with nvidia control panel so you right click Nvidia control panel go to the top adjust image settings pick the middle one configure surround physics 
then choose your gpu right here manage 3d settings program settings then find escape from tarkov if you can't find it there press add and then find it here if it's not here then uh, press browse and then just find it in your computer when you have tarkov right here scroll down to the bottom i'm just gonna scroll through these to show you if you want to know what any of them do then write a comment and i'll uh, make sure to answer you but i just can't be telling you about every setting here but let me just scroll through no like here you probably don't have a 2070 super but just use your gpu right there then go to adjust desktop color settings use your main display these are my settings you don't have to have exactly these the ones i would recommend is digital vibrance adds color to the game gamma makes the game brighter then i have contrast too which makes the dark things darker and the light things lighter all right next thing is play settings select your main display scroll down to advanced display settings display adapter properties monitor and then right here make sure your hertz is also at 165 then you search for power settings like edit power plan then it's called the power options high performance because that's the best if you haven't changed this at all it will be unbalanced just put that on high performance and one more thing open task manager go to details and when your tarkov is running let's say this is tarkov you right click set priority and then set it to high priority all right that's it if this helped you please leave a like and subscribe and like i said if there's anything you want to know write a comment and i'll answer you as soon as i can thank you guys for watching see you in the next one bye bye